What's going on, Crazy Vapory? Going live, just going to invite Hannah. And we're going to have a dual live feed. Two minutes, guys. Invitation's been sent. Awesome. Just wait for Hannah to accept the invitation. Then I'll invite her onto the live feed. So, <clears throat> I see no one's on at the minute. So we'll just wait for a couple of people to join. And Hannah's on. Two seconds. How you doing, Anna? How you doing? You alright? Hi, you alright? Not too bad. I'm trying to find somewhere for my bloody phone to go. Always aware. That's why I said to you, I'd just get one of those fucking tripods off eBay for a quid or a pound shop. Hey, Janie. Hey, Kev. How's it going? Are you guys vaping on tonight? I'm trying to find somewhere for my phone to go. Hi, Michael. How are you? Going on, guys. I'm just going to have to hold my phone, right? <laughs> I don't know what I've got today. <laughs> Cool, isn't it? <laughs> and for a little thing, the Fine. couch. Look, check these out. For a little pen. I don't know if you've had it yet, but I, my coils keep dry burning. No. No matter what you no matter what you do in the face. I'm trying to get this to it's doing my nothing. Some right vape mail today. I've got a 30 mil temple. Epic. Check it out. Oh. <laughs> That's cool, that is. Trust me, I thought, like, I'm wow tired. I am. What is that, Jeannie? Hello. <laughs> oh, crazy bugger. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I got my, uh, got my faro. Yo, pops, how's it going? You keeping it cloudy? <sighs> hey, Lou. Good evening, Fiery. How are you? Yeah, start building my um, e-leaf RDI, I think. Got a deck on that. Fucking hell, that's a nice deck. That's mean, isn't it? Me French. Well, I should be uh, getting my coil master in the next couple of days. Awesome. It's a lot better coil building with the coil master. So a lot better coil building. You'll get better coils because you'll have all the right kits to like get everything. 
scores, all the right players, the cutters are absolutely brilliant. They would just cut for anything. I'm trying to um, find somewhere where I can actually put my phone. Hey, Joe. Um, no, not yet, Michael. I'm, I'm going to collect it tomorrow and I'll have a uh, cloud vid up um, tomorrow afternoon um, of my new iJoy captain that I won. Whoop, whoop. My, my temple's here, Pops. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> I'm doing a build for it now. Um, trying to find somewhere to put my phone. <laughs> I know. That's good, isn't it? Looks good to me. There we go then. Perfect. So what are we all vaping on tonight? Horny mango. I've got my Smart V8 stick and I'm vaping on some Chopper Vapes Twister Lolly. Absolutely gorgeous. Like, it tastes completely the same as the actual ice cream. Crazy. Hey, John. Hey, Imran. How are we all? Um, I don't know what I'm using yet, Pops. I've got some 22-gauge flat wire. Um, and I've got some 26-gauge campful. Are oh, you on the chuckling mad fiery? Some nice juice there. Nice. Hey John. Hey Jeremy. How's it going? Hey look, I got some nice juice earlier. I went into the vape shop and I said, look, I want something different. I want a weird flavour that not many people like. Um, so I've got my farro here. Okay. I feel that. Um, and I've got, some people ain't going to like this, but I love it. I've got some punked. It's peanut butter. And it's mean. It's gorgeous. Mm, I'll have to try that. I love peanut butter. Oh my god, it tastes it tastes so good. It actually tastes like you're dipping your finger in the peanut butter. Oh it's beautiful. Totally we could do a really nice um, peanut butter in the um Divalo or Divalo, however you pronounce it range. Like an eighty VG um, Imran, I've been I've been vaping now for a year. Um, I started on a E Leaf Pico AC Watt, um, and I went on to another AC Watt, the VR80 Stride, um, and then I went on to the iJoy RDTA box. Um, I've had a few actually, and then the Smock G Priv, um, the V8 Stick, Limitless Box Mod, um, <laughs> Tugboat Mech. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. But the best way to start for a beginner is just get your uh, your standard, like, you don't need a big wattage for a beginner. Um, probably a, like a two, three meal tank. Um, I recommend this, to be honest with you. Good flavour, good cloud, V8 stick. And I think they're about twenty nine ninety nine. 99 Abu, how's it going? Easy, man, easy. Nice. Peanut butter is delicious. Yo, Eddie, you keeping it rude? <laughs> oh, chocolate peanut butter would be beautiful. I got my uh, Rude Boy vaping band here. 
Nice one for that, Eddie. Oh, I'll have to check that one out, Fire. Thanks for that. Keep it rude. <laughs> right, what am I going to use? Where's my jig from? Easy now, boo, easy now. I don't know why I'm still wide awake. I've got my little uh, chocolate stash in my vape drawer. <laughs> Kids don't get their hands on it. Where's my wire going? There it is. A boo, you've got to try peanut butter vape. Oh my god, it's delicious. I got some in my farro, absolutely gorgeous. Yes, a boo, do it, get on it. Oh, that'd be so good. Now then, Leon, how's it going? What are you vaping on tonight? How are you guys finding the group? Um, if you've got any uh, questions, queries, advice, anything we're, really that we could uh, possibly do to uh, make it better or whatever, just give us all a message and uh, we'll do the best we can, really. Definitely. Yes, the boo. If you do make the Reese's, I'm trying that. <laughs> Bit cloudy in here. Yeah, they're hitting good. Imran, I'll uh, I'll give you a message once I finish this live feed, and um, I'll uh, I'll give you some uh, advice. I'm not a pro, um, but I can advise you the best I can, and I can get you in touch with people that um, do um, the V8 sticks at a reasonable price as well. So don't worry about that. Well, you yeah. need to really. What you need to worry about, Imran, is just make sure that whatever you're buying isn't mechanical. <laughs> regulated so if you do screw up or whatever excuse my language you fuck up somewhere down the line it's gonna fucking tell you do you know what i mean it's, it's gonna it's not gonna fire the device and it's just gonna tell you that there's a problem and that's the best way to learn because when i when i started i started i'm going back eight years ago when it was all the old shitty fucking e-light cigarettes you have about 10 drags and the fucking battery's flat for a fucking fiver and it was shit so I kind of stopped, and then I started with the um, the Ego C4 with the clear amizers, and that was I kind of stuck at it. But these days, if you get yourself, it doesn't have to be anything expensive. You know, you can pick up them for about twenty quid or whatever. Just go to a reputable dealer, maybe even pop to your local vape shop because they'd be more than happy to advise you as long as it's regulated and you don't start fucking about with box muds and mechanical muds and things like that. Are unregulated, perfectly safe, mate. Twenty-five hour batteries. Uh, don't fuck about with like all the e fest and that, because they're all just fucking rear apps and shit. Just get yourself some uh, LG or some Samsungs. Uh -huh. Samsung twenty-five hours. But if you, if you wanted like Sony VTC three, fours, and fives, that's fine. But just make sure that whatever you're vaping on. It's regulated until you've learned. And don't pick up any like mech muds and things until you've learned some Ohm's law and some basic electronic things like that. And you're perfectly
Do you know what I mean? There's no like vaping. Vaping, the clouds are cloud, a vapor's a vapor. You don't have to own a mech, like have big clouds to actually vape. It's just getting you off the stinkies, getting you on the good stuff. I'll give you an inbox, yep. Imran, and I'll give you some tips in that. That's the problem now, isn't it? A lot of people watch these fucking YouTubers and they watch like all these big massive clouds. And they just they just want a fucking cloud up, man. It's like the other day I was at Mackie D's and that, and there was a couple of kids there and that, and they were just fucking about being dickheads, and they just wanted me to blow big clouds, man. I'm not just thinking. Psh. You know what I mean, there's no, too much. You take care of yourself, my dear. You take care. I'll speak to you soon. But this is the thing with vaping; it's kind of losing its way a little. But it's all about the clouds. But people forget the reason we started vaping in the first place was to get the fuck off the fags. It's just uh, for the for your health's sake. That's what yeah. it is. It's just for, for your health. You've got to keep yourself going. And smoking fags is not keeping yourself going. No, it's not. People it's, forget. It's the way forward. And it's been proven to be the way forward. It has, it has. Public Health England said it's 95% healthier than smoking. And I feel the benefits, because when I was fucking smoking, I could barely walk upstairs. I couldn't even like run to the street without getting out of breath. Now I'm, I feel like my, my breathing's improved. My asthma has mysteriously cleared up. Do you know what I mean? And it is cheaper if you just don't get shiny syndrome like me and spend a fucking fortune and shit you don't need. <laughs> it's you know? hard though, isn't it? It's hard not to spend a fortune because there's so much out there. There's so much that people don't know about. There's so much, so many different tanks, dim many different names, different brands of juice. You never know where to begin. You never know where to end. That's the thing with vaping. It's getting so big yeah, and yeah. so out of the box. It's just like people that are obviously beginning... They're yeah. just entering madness, really, because there's so much out there and so much that, like, even people that have been vaping for years. Yeah. Well, they're the thing still is, going in. The thing is, one thing I've learned over the years is it's like temperature control, right? When that first came out, everybody fucking jumped on that. Everybody just fucking jumped on it. And I was like, I'm going to hang fire. And the reason I hung fire was because I waited about six months and then I kind of got bored with vaping. Altogether. So then when I went and bought a temperature control device six months later after the big hype of temperature control, it was something new to me. So it was something that kept me going in kind of vaping. Well, I, knew, I remember it because it was um, the RX200 by Wismac. And I was like really impressed with the device and it was fantastic. And it stopped me going back to the fags. So kind of like, you have to try and like hold back on all this innovative technology until like a time when you, because everybody gets a bit itchy in vaping. Do you know what I mean? There's the odd time where I've been tempted to have the odd fag and stuff. Because, do you know what I mean? A smoker is always going to be a fucking smoker. But um, in that respect, but if you just don't jump on all the latest products, do you know what I mean? You give yourself something to kind of fall back on. And that's why I bought this e-pipe, because I want something different to try and keep me engaged and interested. Whereas if you're just jumping on everything that comes out in the market, not only are you spending an absolute fortune, it's just, I don't know, it's just crazy, isn't it? It's, it's crazy because, like, I mean, like I said, I've been vaping about eight years on and off now. And, like, the, the amount the market's moving at is just fucking incredible. Like, when you think of, like, how it started with the old cigarette-looking ones and then what we've got now, all old TCR, all these, you know, you can do this and you can do that. It's madness. Madness. But like these new vapors in the last one, two years, that you know, such as yourself that started in the last year, you, you've kind of done it at the right time when the market's full of like really decent products. Because when I started, it was just all shit. 
and then the uh, blue six came out in the news agents and stuff and they're all just shit really really shit products that weren't really satisfying and you only had a choice between tobacco at first and then the menthol came out and then uh, we had the hang seng liquids if i pronounce it right and then you had like just basic cherry and things like that and it tasted like absolute shit it tasted like weak weak old sweaty socks and when you think of some of the flavors that now like like you with the peanut butter and stuff like that. We never had none of that. Right, tighten these screws and then I'll see what it reads in it. So I this RDA, I've been using this RDA for a couple of years. I need to get a, I need to get some new RDAs. But I just haven't bothered because I just thought to myself, what is another RDA gonna do that's better than apart with the exception of my limitless RDTA, I don't see what another RDA is gonna do for me. I don't see what they're gonna bring to the table, but let's see what this comes in at. Excellent. Well, I wanted it point two. Beautiful. I'm happy with that. Yeah, that's a, that's a good idea, in man. Just jump onto Google, man. Jump onto Google. Feel free to ask any questions in the group and everything. And like I said, if you need any advice, just PM me or whatever, or Hannah or whatever on the group and that. Uh, no worries, Imran. I'll give you a message when I finish this live. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'll go from there. If you need any help or advice, we're always here. Um, but, yeah, that's there. Uh, I've just done. It's um, 22 gauge flat wire. Awesome. Looks good, man. It's a bit spaced, so I've got a bit of a leeway there. Five wraps. I'm nearly done. Got to chop me wick. I don't even know what I'm putting these in because I'm not putting them in there. They're too small for that temple. Oh yeah, that temple's got bags of room. Absolute bags of room. Point two, happy with that. Let's 
Get some Heisenberg. So coming in. How's it going? Need a battery in my arms, mate. Six wraps. You put six wraps on it. Looks good to me. Gareth, but I'm going to have to leave you. Go up. I've got 2% battery. Alright. Alright, see you later. I'll speak to you. Have a good I'll speak to you all soon. You all keep it crazy, keep it cloudy, and uh, take care of yourselves. 
Okay, later, bye. guys. Ciao oh. for now. later on that note guys i think we're going to wrap it up if you haven't already go over to our instagram page and like us at the crazy vapory we also have a youtube channel so go over and search for the crazy vapory and get subscribed in there you've already joined our facebook group so keep an eye out for future lives future posts um get sharing uh, get social yourselves Thank you very much for watching this live video. Peace out.